This is like the freaking second time I had to do this. But anyways, we're gonna forget about that, okay? But as I'm loading in, um, I'm playing as Rick Toffin, and I'm doing a voiceover. And yeah, fun. So I got a request in school to do the shield parts in Black Ops for Blood of the Dead. Now, it's based off the map of Mob of the Dead, which was in Black Ops 2. So, you're gonna need a lot of money. I just went into custom mutations for this. And, yeah. So, that's not where the power is. That's just misleading there. Um, and if you hear the voice in the background, I'm sorry. But, so, you just open up that door right there, and the power should be on your left. Right there in the corner, all lonely, with the board of wood right there that says lights out creepily. So, as we have the power on and everything, got our hundred bucks from that brew thing, we open up the catwalk now. Now, uh, th don't mind how uh, badly I play, because I, I don't do so well. Um, my first game playing today, I think. And yeah, so yeah, so as I make my way slowly but surely through this horrible catwalk that they call, um, I'm going to run and I'm going to get knocked. But that's just telling the future there, so I'm a magician. Surprise. Give me a bunny and a hat. Anyways, so I get downed here, and that was my pop socket. But, um, I get down here, I'm sorry, okay. I didn't get any guns, sadly. But, um, yeah, but as I get res, now this is gonna be real chaotic soon, okay? Because, you'll see. Now, the first part is from the warden, which will be right there in the corner, creepily. And I'll kill him soon. But, there's something called the spectral essence, which is the first part, or the second part, however you want to count it. It is the second part to the shield which that's one of the placements as I pick up my mazu from the wall sadly I shoot him in the face and there's your third part which is the key which basically is like the gun of it or like the don't know I don't know wizard wand thing I'll tell you soon um and then I'm gonna show you the now oh sorry alright now there's I only think there's three different placements because there's usually only three different placements. But right there is one part or one placement of the spectral essence, the blue stuff that I picked up before I killed the warden. Um, I'm trying to find the other place, but you can find it. Now I'm not entirely sure that it spawns the place I'm about to show you, but I'm pretty sure it spawns on those like. The bank of the not working afterlife boxes you know those red boxes here I'll show you right there that those afterlife boxes it usually just spawns on them because the only thing it grapples to them now for this third part it'll be soon okay but for the key part you just need to kill the warden not too hard I mean if you don't if you have a mazu then pretty finger looking good I don't recommend it though now, to get the third part, which is the whole entire shield, you're gonna need to go through here, which has body bags on the wall. Pretty creepy, I know. But you're gonna go down here, which is the Citadel Tunnels. It's gonna be somewhere over there, one of the, the shield part of it. And either behind there, behind there, okay. Behind this one, and then you, you guessed it, behind this one too. Okay, well, it, it's gonna be behind one of those, but there's still one more placement though. Okay, and this one's kind of not hard to, it's not that hard to miss. It's right there. It looks like a prison door. That's where it was in my game. And just hold X to pick up the part. Now I'm gonna show you where the crafting benches are. As you can see, I have all three parts right there. I'm gonna show you where the crafting benches are. There's two that I know of in this game, in this map. One's right there, it's up by the harbor, or it's on the docks, as you see in the top left corner. And 
the second crafting bench is in the prison. It's on the t highest floor. And I'll show you where it is pretty soon. But, okay, so I'm going to explain this now. I'll explain a little bit later when I get the shield because I, I trimmed the video a little bit too much. But you know what? It's okay because it happens. So when I get the shield, it's going to be that big door, okay? The key, and the key is like going to have blue fire. All right, I'll just explain to you when I get it. I'll try talking fast, though. And don't mind that. Now I'm just going to run up there. Up those stairs, the uh, CD Street. You're gonna go up those stairs, and it's gonna be on the Broadway part of it, like the uh, highest part. And it's gonna be behind those sh sheets of metal. It's gonna be right there. Now I'm just gonna hold X to craft on it. Building, 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 and then there it is. Boom! The shield. Now the shield is basically a shield with a key that drains lives and souls. And once you get the life and souls, there's a zero at the bottom, bottom right corner, and it does this burst of